everyone, it's Nicole with Stargazer Soaps, and I am going to make a mulberry soap today. This scent, I don't know, there's something about the mulberry scent that just takes me back to something in my childhood, and I don't know what it is. But it's one of those happy scents, and it just smells so good. And I've been looking for a long time for a mulberry scent that I like. This is it. I already have my scent in with my oils and my butters and my clay and my silk. just emulsifying. This is not a straight berry scent. It does have um, cinnamon and vanilla and I can't remember what else. There were a few other components to it as well. It just elevates it. That was just my cream. trying to decide, I hope I'm in the camera, but I'm still trying to decide what I'm going to do here. And it's really fluid. I'm going to blend that up for just one more second here. Just make sure everything is incorporated. I blend everything really well before I add the lye, so. Okay, I have three different colors. I have a purple, a pinkish purple, and then a really light pink. So let's start by adding color. I'm trying to decide if I'm gonna do a drop swirl or an in the pot swirl. I'm leaning toward doing a drop swirl. I think I will. I'm going to add just a little bit more here, a little bit more here, and then I'm going to pour this right back into here. Now I'm committed. Pretty colors. Thank you. I have good taste. Thank you. I've been trying to soap for over a week, well, close to two weeks now. I wanted to get the last of the holiday scents done, and I did. And the last of the twilight scents done, and I did. And I wanted them done a couple weeks ago. But things have just been too hectic and busy in our household. See if that's the color that I want it to be. I hope you can see what I'm doing. Yeah, I think that color will do. What do you think? Yeah. I like that color. Too. Okay. Oh, hey, look, soap on the table. So you can save it up for later, I guess. Alright, let's do this one next. I am going to blend these, but I'm making sure that I don't have any color left on the bottom. I need these to be just a little bit thicker before I can do a dry swirl anyway. Okay. Let me try to clean this up a little bit. Let me scoop. 
scrape down the sides here. Be good. Out of the way, let me clean off my hands. Which PJ is on? It's past bedtime here. We're getting close to, so. sure that I am in camera view. I'm ready to go. So I'm just going to do a bit of a base there. It came out nice and smooth. Mm -hmm. Let's make that down and then add some color. That's pretty. Thank you. Oh. Well, that's fun. Oh well. <laughs> Everywhere. The the red when I dropped the red all over the floor. Yeah, I remember that too. Then it stained, I think. Oh yes. The walls got really clean that day, didn't they? Yeah. Let me try to get some of my soap out of here. Because I would rather you know, be able to use the soap and have it decorate the inside of my mold. And then it dries in here. It's so hard to get it out. Okay. The day of soaping with Nicole. Never a dull moment. It does look like a mold berry. Yeah. Am I still on the video? Yeah. Yes. Oh. <laughs> the one that's on the wrong side of the room. Yeah! You still there? <laughs> okay. Now, let's do the top. I need you to step back, please. You don't have your goggles on. You're too close. Seconds. Okay, let's pause. Okay, just pause for a second because our camera has a 10 minute timer and we were at 30 seconds, so. I'm getting ready to do the top. You're so pretty. Thank you. I'm really happy with this one. Me too. Came out. Came one of my girls helped me pick out which scent to do tonight. We sat on the floor together in front of all of my scents. I got them in a big drawer. And this is the one that we picked. She chose mulberry over monkey farts. 
That's funny. What, what kid doesn't want to use monkey farts? Huh? <laughs> mm. That's a really funny name. It is. Uh, yeah. It actually yeah. smells really good, too. Yeah. That monkey <laughs> farts. <laughs> mm-hmm. I actually haven't soaked with that one yet. You haven't? I haven't. Me too. We will. We will. Just Eventually haven't yet. We will. Eventually we will, yeah. This is the last soap we have on the agenda for a little while. I'm just gonna... Mix this up a little bit more. This soap reminds me of something. I just don't remember. Mulberries? Yeah. <laughs> No, mulberries. Oh, mulberries. Mulberries. That's funny. <laughs> I like that purple and pink. I do too. I'm really happy with the colors. I'm excited to see what it's going to look like inside. Me too. Me too. Oh, that was in the in the pot swirl. This one? Yeah. This was a drop swirl. A drop swirl. You remember we did an in the pot swirl earlier? Oh yeah. Um, Edward was in the pot, wasn't he? Edward. Uh, uh huh. Yeah, I think so. And Jasper kind of had an in the pot swirl. Yeah. Oh, your soaps that you have on your table are really pretty. Thank you. We've done three other soaps today. This is number four. This is the last one of the night. By the time I get to four, I'm done. My back starts to hurt. And my hands have been cramping. and At least cleanup is fairly easy. I just let the bowl sit for a day or two. Everything inside turns to saponified soap, which means it's usable. And I just put it in my dishwasher. I don't need to add any other soap. And it comes out squeaky clean. There's it's super easy. Pink on the side. Down there? No, um, on oh, your, on the, on your bar. Right? On my mold? Yeah, right there. Right there? Okay. Yeah. There's some pink on the All right. Clean up my splatters. <laughs> my gloves. I don't think you're messy, so. Really? Mm -hmm. I just poured half my soap down the side? <laughs> Not on the table? Either. You're sweet. Yeah, I'm messy. <laughs> you're both really sweet. Funny, <laughs> but sweet. Okay. Are we still in the thing? Yeah. Just a little bit. All side. right, I'll move in just a second. Same thing with my cloths. Um, I can't wash them when they're like this because it would gum up my sink and my drains. So they sit for a few days. I have a whole bunch of them, and then I run them through the wash after all of the soap is saponified. Ooh, kind of at a funny so angle pretty. here. I just really like that. Good. I'm happy with that. You gonna let me sell this one, or are you gonna want to keep it for yourselves? Keep, keep it for yourselves. Ah, you're funny. <laughs> well, we can keep some, but we do have to sell some of it. But we should keep all of it. <laughs> well, we could if we wanted to. I can always make more too. <laughs> make some just for us. Is that um so it can get out? This? Yeah. No, it's just a. Uh, give me some clean edges there. You don't always do that sometimes. It actually re looks really fun to make soap. It is really fun to make soap. Mm -hmm. I love to make soap. One of my girls and I, we discovered that we could watch soaping videos on YouTube on our TV yesterday. She <laughs> stayed home from school with a bad, bad migraine <laughs> and... Uh, all she wanted to watch were mine, my videos, but 
That was kind of cool to be able to watch them on the TV. Yeah, did not know that. I was going to say, were you going to put the glitter on? Of course. You I almost be, forgot yeah. that I had time. Of course, your sisters came home. She's like, guess what I did? <laughs> so now they all want to watch soapy videos on TV. Yeah, that was actually really fun. It was yeah. pretty fun. All right, so there's Mulberry. That is not the name, of course. We will come up with a name before we cut it. Hopefully, we usually do. We can name it Strawberry. <laughs> <laughs> there isn't a star named Strawberry. Oh. Um, so this we will cut in a couple of days. And don't turn off the video because it will be at the end of this video. Thanks for watching. Bye. Okay, here is Mulberry. Uh, my Mulberry. This is, actually, I'm going to call this Nebula. My husband picked the name on this one. This one smells incredible. I have been walking by this soap all day as it's been sitting in its mold just to smell it because it smells so good. It smells even better today than it did yesterday. And look how cool that is. So I did a drop swirl. A little bit of an air pocket there, but that happens with drop swirls sometimes. I'm really happy with this one. I'm going to be in trouble too because the kids are in bed. And I'm not supposed to be cutting soap. Or so they've told me while they're in bed. But they'll see it tomorrow. Looks pretty cool. Hopefully you can see this with the lighting. And the last one. So this is Nebula. And this will be fully cured November 30th. I will have it on my site available for pre-order here in a couple of weeks. Um, so keep an eye out at stargazersoaps.com. Thanks for watching.